lethal predators lurk in Africa's waters. But the most deadly and fearsome of them all gets its name from the continent's mightiest river. No living creature is safe from the Nile crocodile. The Nile crocodile is the largest of all the African crocodilians. This is an animal that can easily reach, I would say, six meters. Um, and I've seen them that size in Africa. This is an animal that can take down a full-grown buffalo. I've actually seen the Nile crocodile take down a full-grown giraffe. The Nile crocodile may be Africa's most perfectly evolved killer. It's so successful, it hasn't had to change in millions of years. 80 million years not to have changed just shows you how well adapted. I mean, they call them the, the, the living dinosaurs. This dinosaur has survived because it's a pure killing machine. It has size, up to 2,000 pounds. It has strength, with one of the animal kingdom's most powerful bites. And it has patience to wait for the perfect moment to kill. They actually sort of sit and wait predators, they're opportunistic. They won't necessarily go out and hunt, but if something comes by, they'll be, they'll be first to nab it. Grab usually the head or neck region, spin around, and they'll drown the animal. Straight underwater, and they just pin it in a position for how long it takes for the animal to drown. People living along Africa's rivers and lakes know this killer all too well. Crocs take down hundreds of people every year. Locals recognize and respect a crocodile's hunting ground. But unwary outsiders may not read the warning signs. It's a mistake they only make once. So if you see an animal in the water, you probably only see the top of its head, yet it can smell, it can see, and it can hear. The Nile crocodile is a stealth attack machine, and its head is a sophisticated surveillance center. Their senses are very well developed. Sense of smell is absolutely unbelievable. Their vision, they have binocular vision and also their sense of hearing. And all, all of those senses are actually located on the top of their head. But that's not all. Tiny sensors around its snout are highly sensitive to vibrations. Even in the darkest waters, the slightest movement gets the croc's attention. The Nile crocodile can stay submerged for up to two hours on just one breath. But when it comes time to move, it strikes with shocking speed. You see the eyes, and they seem to be able to move without making a single ripple. It's like it's motionless, like a leaf floating across the surface of the water. And then all of a sudden, explode out of the water with a power and immensity that is beyond words and description. When a crocodile of that size closes its mouth, it has a pressure of over 10,000 pounds pressure per square inch. So it's an immense amount of power. And in the neck, there are tremendous muscles in that neck that give this animal the force to grab, hold, and pull into the water. And it happens so so quickly, it, uh, it really is it's almost unbelievable to watch. The croc doesn't kill its prey by wounding it. It relies on drowning with humans shot and pure fear. Lungs go into bronchospasm. You can't get air in, usually due to fear or fright, and as a result, you end up cutting off your own air. Within a few minutes, it's all over. Humans rarely survive an attack from the Nile crocodile.